Okay, this is Paul Membert. I've hit level 20 alchemy. And I've been going to show you the next step leveling, exploiting the web quest. There's a web quest at level 25 in quarry mill that is a charity type. It uses high potions. Various craft high potions is level 20. Takes distilled water, mountains, mistletoe, and gill bun. You can get the distilled water. You cannot get any of the materials at this place. You see. However, there's a shop in the Ruby Road Exchange. I'll show you in a second. You can get the distilled water at the marketplace. We'll get to the shop in a minute. Go to the Tradecraft Merchant. You can get the distilled water here. It's easier to do so. The other ingredients, I check the market board. Sometimes you can give dirt sheet, sometimes you cannot. I was like, I find another way to get the mistletoe. Though. It's not a big deal. It's easy to get from Botany. I'll get back to you in a few minutes. Hello, Gilbun is located Botany just outside of the Hartford Hunt. It's very easy to obtain. Very easy to get the bun. I will show you how to get the mistletoe in just a little while. I'm going to stop filming right now and finish getting my gill bun. The Matronas mistletoe is found just outside of Quarry Mill. Quarry Mill is a big town. You can probably camp out here. This is the idea. I get enough to get from 20 to 25 alchemy of her materials and I will see you a little bit for the next phase of this synth. This is my next phase. We are actually doing craft. I got the materials. We're going to craft high potions. As always, <laughs> try to HQ these. They will give you more EXP. 
Persif. Bad news is they are harder to do. Now we're in our final phase of this leveling. I got alchemy all the way up to 25. As you see. Don't mind the gear right now. Not that important. I go by Vaddy. The Valier's first of all poses. You could get silver sand and some lightning and water shards as reward. This is a charity type webcast. I have 89 allowances, so it I got plenty of time. And you just go over here. I did over 400 cents on this high potion. 
Oh, mostly using the quick synthesis. So I was lazy today, and I've also wanted more to trade in. Yep. I only was successful with two eight screws. Broke a few. But I like I don't know how many I could go get eleven thousand per trade in. You got thirty three thousand EXP per allowance. And that's a big jump. That's when I've already hit level 26 on just free trade allowances. I'll get back to you when I'm done trading this stuff and see the big boost I will get. I'm down to my last two trade up for two more allowances. I started like 90 allowances, now I'm down to 30. That tells me how many allowances I did. I'm up to level 36, almost 37. I started at 25. About halfway through 25. I'll show you some more a little bit. I hit 37. This is my last trade in and I don't have enough for another allowance at a time. I'll show you those up and I started out with no silver set. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven stacks of silver stand plus a parcel of 66. I had none to start. I started off with no lightning shards, no water shards when I did it. Now I got 912 and 756. That's a lot of shards. Not to mention I'm at from 25 to 37. It's probably nice because I don't have to worry about all the expensive stuff. I mean expensive. Uh, 
There's a lot more potions. I must basically find a level 4 event class I can exploit. Until then, this is all I have for leveling up alchemy. And I'll see you soon.